Attention buyers of Windsor and Essex County, we got some great data for you for the 2024 stats. So looking at first off, the median sale price. We're actually up 4% for the median sale price compared to last year. But if you look at a three year average of the median sale price, we're actually down 1% this year. So things are starting to come back up in regards to pricing. Let's take a look at the median days to sell. So how long it takes to sell a property. Right now, it's actually no change compared to last year. We're at a 0% change. However, it is 34% longer of a sale time this year compared to the three year uh, average of the median sale time, right? So things are taking a little bit slower to sell, which is great for buyers because you don't have to worry about things hitting the market and then all of a sudden being sold the day after. A lot of people struggled with that over the last few years. So things are starting to get a little bit better for buyers in that regard. Number of new listings, we're actually up 9% compared to last year. So more listings are hitting the market this year, giving buyers more options to pick from. And we're actually up 3% compared to the three year average. So things are really you know, moving a lot more this year in regards to sellers coming forward with their listings. However, sales are down. Sales are down 2% compared to last year and a whopping 25% down from the three year average. This gives buyers a great opportunity because more listings are hitting, less listings are selling, which means an accumulation of inventory. So buyers have a lot of properties to pick from, which gives you the upper hand in the current market right now. Average number of active listings is actually at 15% compared to last year. So a lot of options to pick from. If you have any questions regarding the stats, give me a call. Nick Monteleone with Team Monty. I'll be happy to answer your questions and help you transition into buying or selling your next property.